Hi guys. All right. Um, it's a new channel for me. I usually on my son Alex. Alex and Dad. We do comic books and stuff like that. Um, and um, so I just wanted to kind of do my own thing. So um, this is a little about me and what I do. I do Napoleonics. I do uh, Warhammer. I do Warhammer 40k. I do a lot of sci-fi models. I do all kinds of neat stuff like. Uh, I, I do stuff like this, and um, pretty cool. And what I got on my head here is I picked it up at the hobby store, which is a, um, it helps me paint detail. Let's see if you can actually see this, or if I, if I don't, like, kind of mess it up. But I don't know if you can see that. It'd probably come out really weird. But it's a pretty neat, um, pretty neat device that I use. And um, so I do all kinds of weird stuff. So um, let me let me just show you. Oh, that was nice. Are you still on? <laughs> You're still going. We're still rocking. Okay. What a Nim. All right, Nimrod. Actually, Nimrod from the Bible is actually a pretty smart fella. I don't, so I don't know why I call myself Nimrod. That was pretty uh, pretty stupid of me to do that. But hey, maybe you want to remember that book. Boy Hammer, Road Trader, yeah, cool book. Um, so let's get on with it. This, speaking of old stuff, back in the day, it's one of my first stuff that I bought when I was in the Marine Corps in the 1980s, and that was around uh, Camp Lejeune in uh, Cherry Point, North Carolina, when I picked up my first Marine set, which was pretty cool. And I also got the Imperial Guard stuff, which uh, let's take a look at it here. This is some old stuff. Is these this is original stuff that I got right here, which I've kept right there. I got this on eBay, these space looks. But this stuff is mine. And uh wait till you see this. Um this actually, if I can do this right. There we go. Look at that, huh? There it is. It's still there. Woo! How about that, huh? Nice. So, we got a lot of nice stuff. And this is my room. I got a lot of artwork. I got some Star Trek stuff. Star Trek spaceships. I got some uh, original artwork there. Uh, pictures of uh, B-17 up there, along with some P-40 Warhawks. And then... Um, I got my Gettysburg. I got my Marine Corps cover. Uh, this is an old. I got that on eBay. That's an old uh, campaign cover from the Marine Corps. And then we go over here. We got some tanks and stuff that I built for uh, bolt action, which came out pretty cool. A Panzerkampf wagon, a Tiger tank. You know, there's a Sherman. And then I did some uh, that. Uh, what you call it? The terrain for uh, Warhammer 40k. So I did that. And that's in there. And you come around. This is the 55th line. The, my Napoleonics that I was working on right there. And we slide right into um, some Imperial Guard here. And then we got some girls here working working in the farm the diorama and then we got these guys here this rock here came from the Gettysburg Park I picked it up off our um, little round top and then here we got uh, some cannons from line cannons from the French came out pretty good and then we have uh, some line artillery here on the move and we got some British lifeguards British dragoons Royal Dragoons to the first and second lifeguards, and uh, there's three squadrons there with uh, the Dragoons. Then we got some French Curriers, and we got all this cr crap down here that I gotta build. We got bases uh, for the stuff there that I, I buy. I get them on eBay real cheap. So that's pretty cool. I got my uh, Works Drift stuff, the Leha Saint that I gotta build, and then I got some other stuff down here and we come up around here we got my artwork on the wall Captain America 
Vampirella, a Conan poster, and my Marine Corps monument, Captain America. We got um, uh, that one that I was building. It's a little dawn set coming in. We got some Battlestar Galactica stuff. Coming back up, we got Captain America. We got comic books, original comic books, original artwork for Zeta, Vampirella, Tucci's uh, Sergeant Rock, GI Combat. Then up there, we got some uh, GI Combat. We're usually fighting Tiger tanks for some reason. But there's the old Stuart. There's the mismatch tank. And there's the, the end up uh, going back into a Sherman. So that's what we look at. But I, I got a tiger here, and I put a tiger tank there. They're always fighting tiger tanks for some reason. It's no, uh, like a steward's gonna take out a tiger, but eh. I know it's not realistic, but hey, I was a kid, and, and I, I enjoyed it. And now we're looking at, let's see if we can't come back a little bit so we can get a full pan on what we're looking at. All right, so this is what we're looking at. This is my wall. This is like all kinds of artwork. You know, it's nice to come home and just relax and and do my thing. And basically, that's that's what I do. I have a lot of stuff. I got a lot of a lot of reference material here. A lot of artwork. Um, anything that I can reference. You know, whether it's going to be um, c collecting comic books, uh, building models, painting, Napoleonics. You name it, it's there. Um, more reference material and stuff, and it's just a lot of stuff. And we come up here, we got more artwork here, right? It's just some neat stuff. And we come down, and we sail into here. I was Simon Bisley did that for me at Comic Con. Man, that was awesome. What a great guy. Down to earth, funny. Great guy, great artist too. It's all my comic book reference material here. All the old um, Overstreet price guides for comic books. And then more reference material for coins, comics, artwork, all that neat stuff. And then uh, we come over here, and again, more artwork. And it's just stuff that I like. And keeps me happy and fun. And we got some old stuff here too. We got some, we got some old Dungeons and Dragons stuff here. This is when I, when I was in the Marines and I did the Dungeons and Dragons here. And so this is old stuff, and then we come back, we come, we come right up into uh, here. And that's the old 172nd stuff, the stuff I have on my uh, workbench is the f uh, 28 millimeters, but I remember back in the day when we were kids, this was, the, this is what we had. We had the old, uh, the old Airfax stuff, you know, that's what it was, you know, so that's the old Battle of Waterloo set there with the last saint. So, um... Yeah, and then I think uh, I got more comic books down here, and I got some more stuff over here that I got to take care of here. And then we got uh, we got some figs and some models and stuff. These are all 48 millimeters, so that's gonna go with bolt action, you know. And then we got some uh, we got some more sci-fi stuff, the uh, spaceship from. Uh, 
Forbidden Planet. We got When Worlds Collide right here. And of course my favorite my favorite bomber is B-17. But that's what we're looking at guys. So this is my introduction. This is you know, all flintlock stuff. So that's about it. Um, so let's see uh, see what we can do and get this show on the road and see if you enjoy what I do and and what I what I gotta say. This is my uh, wall of old movie stars that I went William Shatner and Elvira, uh, Cassandra Peterson, um, and that's uh, oh, oh boy, that's cool. He plays in Spartacus, and I lost his name, but that's not. Well, hey, it is what it is. We'll figure it out. I'll remember it after. It's on the tip of my tongue. But, guys, I want to thank you, and uh, we'll see what happens. Um, and uh, we'll go from there. We got some battle, battle tech stuff right there, and then uh, some other stuff there. So, that being what it is, it's time to go and get this on YouTube. So, this is the end.